All right, everybody. Now is the best time of the day, dinner time. And we did go to Mellow Mushroom today. Um, instead of buying the pizza and getting all the decked out toppings, we actually made our own pizza. Final product here looking amazing. It's definitely an amazing looking meal for the one year vegan anniversary for myself. I got you. There we go. There we go. Figuring it out. Awesome. So here we go. So we literally just got just the tomato sauce and the bread, and then you saw us making this delicious piece here. Yeah. Delicious pie. So this looks really good. It's pretty heavy. It Got the amazing. broccolini in here, tomatoes, avocado, nutritional yeast, mushrooms. And then, oh, I think that was it, right? Yeah. And a little bit of uh, caramelized onions as well. And I did put a little Cajun on it, so it might be a little spicy. Chipotle. Chipotle. But we're gonna cheers it up. Cheers. For many more years. Being vegan, yes. Mm, mm, mm. Oh. Almost forgot to add some hip seed. Oh, yeah. And some red pepper flakes. And the red pepper flakes. Yeah. So I, like, I always like with my pizza a little red pepper flake. And we're going to add the hemp parts just for some extra protein on it. Should give it a nice little extra crunch as well. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Delicious. Mm -mm -mm. So this is really good. It just goes to show that you can still eat really good food, even though you're vegan. We don't always eat this food. This is like a good treat food. We thought today would have been a perfect day to try this food. And we're washing it down with some of my good homemade kombucha that I've been making. Definitely, if you want to make your own kombucha, check out the link up above and you can watch my guide how to make it from start to finish. This one is blueberry lime and it's really good. It's a little sour if you like sour drinks, but I think it's awesome. I like it. It's pretty good. So kombucha is one of those fun vegan little hippie drinks that you can make. Um, very low in sugar once the sugar eats itself. Uh, it's quite refreshing. It's a nice little carbonation and it's fun if you make your own because you can try out different flavors. I'm thinking for the fall season, trying to make a pumpkin one, like a pumpkin spice with fresh pumpkin in it. So that's what I'm excited to try out as well. But yes, yes, it is amazing being vegan. I'm so proud of making it one whole year. I can't wait to see what we look like in five years, 10 years, 20 years. And the party is just getting started. So I don't know about Kat, but I think we're ready to dive in and eat this delicious I've pizza. Already been She's already <laughs> been eating it. So hopefully y'all enjoy watching this video today. Please make sure to give this a thumbs up if you're on the vegan journey. If you like to have treat days, please let me know in the comments. I'm also curious of how, how long have you been vegan yourself? Since today's the one year, I want to see who else has been maybe your one month, two month, three months, six months five years, 10 years, however long, please let us know. And I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day. Namaste. Do, 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 do. Oh my goodness.